I think the best way that you can actually prove to yourself the difference between a conventional acrylic paint like Golden Heavy Body and the interactive paint which is able to go in two directions to dry quickly or to remain re-wettable, I think we just need to do this over a time lapse. All right. We're into our second hour now. I'm just going to do a quick check. This is golden, heavy body that's dry. And Atelier Interactive is also dry. I'm painting some cadmium red light across there. And I haven't got any problem with the color underneath picking up. Atelier Interactive, it's dry so I can overpaint quite happily. Unlocking formula wasn't designed to re-wet the golden paint, so I'm sorry I've got a little bit of cadmium on my paintbrush, but as you can see, it's not doing anything to the paint underneath. I've cleaned my brush up a bit more, and I've put some unlocking formula on here. So I really want to, want to mix these two colours together. Okay. So I'm doing that. I might want to mix the, the cadmium red into them, mightn't I? We've had a time lapse of half an hour. The golden heavy body paint has dried. And so it's going to be pretty easy to overpaint it with a real mild yellow light and it's not picking up. Overpaint the Atelier Interactive without picking up the blue or the white. However, if I suddenly had a rethink and I decided that I wanted to blend the yellow with the white and the blue. If I apply some unlocking formula, put a little bit too much, so it's got a little watery, hasn't it? But I think you can sort of get the idea that it's still possible to overpaint and it's possible to blend so that we We've achieved the impossible with acrylics. We've entered the realm of oil painting, haven't we? We're blending wet in wet, even though the paint has actually physically dried. We'll just do one last effort at this. I'm going to use the water atomizer this time. Well, it's not a water atomizer, it's an unlocking formula atomizer. And that allows the unlocking formulas to penetrate the paint easily before you start swishing the brush around in it. And there it goes. So it's 11.30 till 3.30 is four hours. Can I say that if you discover at the end of the day something that isn't quite right, the spray can absorb into the surface of the painting if you want to make last minute adjustments, which might save you the pain of having to repaint a small area of your painting if it's not working correctly.